One of the top running backs returning to 23-6A is Pearlands, Dominic Cerna. He ran for 709 yards as a junior, including 99 of them on this play in week one. Cerna runs a 4.6 and will team up with Kennedy Lewis to give the Oilers quite the one-two punch in the backfield. Cerna may be the Houston area sleeper running back for 2021. At Alif Taylor, the Lions welcome back wide receiver Tyler King. King is a speedy wideout that defensive backs have to respect or he will blow right past them. As a junior, he caught 20 passes for 230 yards and a couple of scores. He runs a 10.21100 and is a two-time state track medalist. King was a first-team all-district selection and does damage on the kick return game as well. He'll be going to Texas Tech after this season. Elite Hastings defensive end David O'Key is trouble on the line. At 6'4", 235 pounds, O'Key is tough to block with even two guys as he uses his high football IQ to find ways around you. He has gotten several D1 offers and should get more his senior season. Look for O'Key to be big problems for offenses in the district. Another huge defensive prospect in this district is Carolan safety Dylan Dixon. He had four picks last year for the Oilers, including one he brought back for six. And he could play linebacker as well as safety. Dixon had 52 tackles and forced a couple of fumbles, which was enough to catch the eye of several D1 schools. When it was all said and done, Dixon decided to verbally commit to the University of Colorado.